What is up everyone, Sir Shed here, back in Scorched Ark Survival Evolved on the Scorched map. Right, just want to say before I start, I have a community Discord that you're all welcome to join. Actually, let's go into third person for this. I've got a community Discord you're all welcome to join. I love the waving in this. Huh, you can wave and not at the same time. So yeah, come join the Discord, link is in the description down below. And if you want to join this server that I'm currently on, the inf the... IP is in the description and all the information for the server is on Discord as well. Sorry, just had a slight hiccup there. Right, also if you haven't subbed yet, then subscribe to me on YouTube and like the video, why not? Right, so you'll see here I have replaced all of my foundations with metal, finally. And I've done all of my wiring. This wiring was, I'd like to say it was a pain to do, but it wasn't, it was really simple, it just took a while to let all the metal smelt and if I go into here I've got now 2254 metal and there's one of the vaults placed down but before I can do anything else I need to get the rest of the vaults down so this episode I'm going to be building my base and showing you all how I do it so right I'm going to want to go is it going to say obstructed because of the cable? No, 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 that cable's got nothing to do with it. Right. Mm -hmm. I want to get this as lined up as possible. How's that looking at the top? Hmm. This already has to stick out a little bit further. Which is kind of annoying. And it takes up both of them, so there's going to be a whole vault that can't be used. Right, is that good? I think that's good. Does that look good to you? Looks good to me. Ta-da! Right, now go out here and just check quickly. Can it be accessed? Access inventory and this one. Access inventory. Perfect. So that's just two volts there, I can't get a third one. That's going to suck, because it is going to mean that a few volts aren't accessible, but what I'm going to have to do is just have a ceiling on the top and a drop down bit where you can get into them. Right, next volt is going to be the corner one here. So, let's just... Okay, oop, excuse me. Need to move back a little bit. How's that doing? What's the problem now? Okay. Why won't you let me place that any closer? Is it because of the cable intersection? Come on, because I need these to be like flush with each other. Actually, yeah, because I don't want a player to be able to walk through the gap in the middle. Which they won't be there. Won't even be able to shoot through it, but... Right. Hmm. In theory, I should be fine here to keep placing them. Come on, a little bit more. Is it still thinking it's inside me? Yeah. There. That should... Oh, for God's sake. There we go. Right, so I want this, again, as close to there as possible. That is not very close. Actually, it's pretty, it's pretty close, I think. And I can overlap that by quite a bit there. Excellent. There we go. So this doesn't look perfect in any way, shape or form. I have no idea what that was that just disconnected. That was one of my hard drives. Sorry about that, everyone. If I by some miracle actually remember, I will mute that when I edit it. Okay, can't fit through a one wide doorway with an RG. Right, let's just park the RG outside. Doesn't need to be in the house. Right. Okay, so that is fine. Next one is gonna go at this bit here. Hmm. Okay, I need it to be Straight. Okay, that's clipping weirdly. This 
See, the problem is I don't know if I'm going to be able to actually access it at that distance from the window. Uh, let's just have a look and see. Am I actually stuck inside the vault right now? I am. Okay, everyone, I'm just going to have to cheat quickly to get out, actually. Uh, cheat ghost. Ah, oh, good, yeah. thought that might happen. Cheat walk. There we go. Right, can I access it? Yes, I can. Good. Right, and there's still... Can you walk around the back there? No. Good. So if someone breaks through the walls, they can't walk around the back of the vaults there. But they can do here. And here. So once they get in, they can get all the way through the base. But hopefully this will be enough space to place an auto turret in. So that'll be a nice surprise for them. Can't walk through there either. Right then. Next vault. I'm going to put up in this corner so I don't accidentally block myself off from the whole area. Right. Right, this is going to be one of the completely inaccessible ones. So it doesn't really matter too much where this one's placed. I'll put it yeah, there. So hopefully no one can walk either side of it. Actually, if I have it further back, then I might be able to get more vaults accessible on this side. Oops. Come on, we can do this. Right, and now... Now comes the problem. Problem being, I haven't placed the vaults the same way, which was really rather stupid of me, because they're not complete square, are they? Damn. Right. See now, how the hell am I gonna... Hmm. Go, let's try. Is that gonna be good? Come on, I had it a second ago. Where's it? No. Oh, had it there. For God's sake, this is such a pain. There we go. But, but I want it. Oh, that's going to have to do. Cheat. Ghost. Of course, you could do this without having to go into ghost mode to get out of them. By um, not placing your balls down first. There we go. Okay. Can you walk through that gap? No. That's something at least. A shame we can't fit a vault there. Oh, I have really miscounted vaults. I've got five left. Oh yeah, of course, because it was bigger before and then I changed the size of the actual base. Well, I feel like a bit of an idiot. If it didn't cost so much, I'd be very tempted to rip it all down and start again. Right. That goes there. I can access that vault. I can access that vault. I can access that one. Wait, can I? Okay. Let's just rename them all. One. Okay, this is a different one I'm looking at here. Two. Three vault I can't access. Uh, makes you four. Uh, this one's going to be five. I hate that I keep post putting E in there. Uh, that's five. Oh, I can actually get the inventory of six. Six. Seven. Oh crap, I'm about to die. Come on. Eight. Okay, is that eight there? Yep. That means that one there is number nine. 
don't like how it keeps getting really dark. That's kind of ominous. Nine. I'm just going to let myself die. Ten. And that makes you... Eleven. Right. Anyway, I'm not going to die of heat stroke now. What is my health at? Thirty-seven. Get into the cave. Right. Here we go. That's a little bit better. I mean, I'm still going to die, and I'm starving to death. That Parasera up there is Kira's. She was taming a rock elemental, which is now over at her base. It's really cool. I had a little go with it. And the taming method is still over here. Right, am I still going to be dying? I'm not super mega flamey heat anymore, so that's something. But I think I'm going to get thirsty soon, aren't I? So I'm just going to eat like 600 odd berries. And that should about do it. Let's take the fibre. Right. So, constantly dying of heat is going to be an issue in that base. So... So there's not really anything I can do with it apart, about that, apart from have an upper floor made of adobe. Which I'll probably do. Right. Let's take pickaxe. Oh yeah, electric prods. I've been getting loads of them from killing mantises. Manti. Whatever. <clears throat> Sorry, my voice just really croaky there for some reason. It's better than the voice crack I normally get, I suppose. Oh yeah, still got like 50 walls left over. Let's take half of that. No, I don't need... Uh, actually, yeah. Because I'm going to... Oh. 157. A little bit better. I'm going to need to make up a whole load of more cement in post. Right. Yes, I get it. You're very hot. You'll be fine. Right, you take half of that and make 40. And you take that and make 39. Right, what have I got left? 21 metal walls. So I'm thinking. Right, let's demolish that. Here we go. Hmm. Okay, that was weird. Not sure where I placed that then, but okay. Okay, got that one up there. Can I get that back one? Nope, not gonna clip. Oh. Nope, not gonna work there. Well, I did actually make a whole load of um, refining forges and everything spare to replace these, because I thought I might have to rip them down. But luckily I didn't, right. That shelf goes there, and up there will be... Oh, right, I'm going to die in a minute. Okay. I have a cannibal's also, Kira's. She left them in there for some reason. Come on, take them. Take that. Right. Is that a good placement for it? I think that's good. And so for now I have these three up here. Right, you just get demolished please. Ugh, I'm going to be dying a lot in my base now, aren't I? Right, let's just quickly go and... Ah, oh, crap. Actually, yeah, let's do that. Oh, I didn't put that in the right place so I can't block off that side. Oh uh, well. Get this wall here. Oh. Oh well. Right, let's respawn quickly in the cave. Just got loads of sleeping bags in there at the moment. Oh, and the sleeping bag just broke. Yeah, there's a fractured sleeping bag. <laughs> Where am I? Okay, I'm down here. Have you got a saddle? No. But you have got levels. Uh, 137, you can get more health. There you go, almost 2k now. 
Hey Thorn, how are you doing? No levels on you. Alright. This is annoying. I've got, I think, 50 fortitude now? 60 fortitude, actually. And, yeah, it's not doing anything. Which I thought it would do. Apparently, uh, once you get to 30 fortitude, nothing else works. Like, it doesn't do anything else. Oh, cool, there's still some cannonballs left. So, in theory, I could borrow the Parasur to tame myself a rock golem. But, I'm not going to tame a rock golem until I've got some kibble for it. Rock golem kibble is mantis egg. To get a mantis, to tame some manti, I'm going to need to be making bug repellent. Which means, that first, I just want to place these down. Nope, not going to let me put one there. I can put that one there at least. I can put that there. There we go. And that's all of them. Right. So, yeah, in the middle here, I'm going to have a hatch frame. Probably going to have this first room. Yeah, just too high. Can I make any more s metal ceilings at the moment? Seal. Right. Uh, metal ceiling. Cementing paste. Okay. Hello, cementing paste. 40. And. 39. I'm probably just going to keep those mortars there until I make some more. Oh, and a thorny just fell on top of my vaults. Great. Where are you? Is that my vulture attacking it? Yes. I think my vulture did. Wait, let's take a look at the tribe log quickly. Uh, no, it doesn't say anything. Be cool if you could see a um, dino log to find out what they've been doing. All right, uh, you can just stay there, dead. Let's take all of that. All right. So as I was saying, I want some ceilings. Seal. Uh, eight would be good. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Eight. All right. Let's just start placing these down. So I'm going to want them up there like that. Then there is going to be my hatch frame to the next floor. Right. And on the next floor I'll probably put like another smithy and everything up there. Because I've made them, so I may as well use them. So I'm going to want a wooden ladder. Right. And one more. Is that right? You got one more for me? Oh, two. Did I only need seven? Or have I missed one? Ah, I missed one there. There we go. Excellent. Right. Wooden ladder. Uh, just need the thatch and the fibre. There's the fibre. Do I not have any thatch? Yeah, there I do. Right. Lad. Yeah, let's just get one of them. And we could put that. I don't want it there. Does it have to go there? Yeah, it does. And this is going to be our next floor. We have all the vaults accessible. Again, I'm going to put a ring of hatch frames around. But I like this. Yes, that one's easy accessible. It's just round here where I messed up. Yeah. So that needed to be placed further into the corner. Then I could have gotten three on that wall. Yeah. Hmm, probably shouldn't have done that. Yeah, definitely shouldn't have done that. But at least if people get here, they can't get into my base. But I can't, you know, get back out. Demolish the window wall. There we go. Sorry, had to be done. Take all of that. And then search window. And let's make... A whole bunch of them. Make an extra because I am going to need them eventually. Right, and then I'm just going to encase this last bit around here. This is so that if people manage to get into the base, they can't just immediately get the vaults. I will pin code them, but I'm going to do that off camera because I'm not a moron. And don't plan on showing everyone my pin code in case they do join the server. Hmm. 
Perfect. Right, so that opens. Ooh. Okay, thought of an issue. Yeah, now I can't access that corner one. Okay, this one will go without. So I can still get into that corner. Right, take that. Hey, what? Oh, wow, you die so quickly in there. Oh, dear. Well, I'm not mega da um, death heat anymore. Okay, so... I really need an adobe layer. So what I think I'll do here is just have this one ceiling high. Oh, don't fall down. This will be one ceiling high. And then on top of that, I'm going to have an adobe layer. And I'll turn this top three... Yeah, top three ceilings all into adobe. Right, so I will cut back when I've got everything ready to go.